Okay, I'd like to ask you guys, what are your values in life? I think it's like pretty basic. I just want to be happy, find happiness in small things. What do you do in your day-to-day -day life to embrace those small things and be appreciative of the small things in life? I think, I think it's a mindset thing. It changed for me when I turned 30. Like 30 was coming up, I was like, I haven't achieved so many things that I thought I should have achieved when I was turning 30. And at that point I was like, I need to let go of all those expectations of what I need to have achieved this year, in five years, and just be happy in the moment. Every day in life, we wake up and make a series of choices. And ideally, these choices align with what we call our values. I've been thinking a lot recently about what my values are, and I also wanted to connect with other people to understand what are their values, specifically here in the Netherlands. So today, that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna go around and talk to different people and understand what their values are. And I'd also like it if you shared your values with me down in the comments. If you're curious what mine are, stay tuned because I'll be sharing four throughout this entire video. Nou, ik zal jullie graag vragen, wat zijn jullie waarden in het leven? Nou, ik denk voor mij uh, respect. Gewoon voor alles wat leeft, voor iedereen, voor mensen en dieren en aarde. En, ja, alles is met alles verbonden en nou, dat verdient alle respect, denk ik. Ja, dat is mooi, dat is mooi. En jij meneer? En ik denk voor mij uh, zaterdag een ijsje <laughs> en zondag zou je rusten. <laughs> Rust, orde en regelmaat. Ja? ja? En, en waarom? Waarom zijn die? Dat maakt het leven allemaal een stuk rustiger. Ja? Ja. En respect voor iedereen. Nou, my first value that I want to talk about is quality relationships. Now, what do I mean by that? Uh, you know, for me, I think it's very important that those close to me feel loved, feel seen, that I share my time with them, and that they really feel like I'm investing into the relationship that I have with them and not just a superficial level relationship just because you know they're family or just because I call them a close friend or just because it's my girlfriend. Like, I really want people that I consider close in my life to fill that. And of course, I'm not perfect. Of course, I may not always do my best with all the relationships in my life and you know give this quality of attention or quality of love that I would love to do. But for me, I try as best as possible and it's something that I consider a very, very important value in my life. Goed wonen, dit is echt heerlijk wonen hier. Gewoon goed, ik hoef geen rijke dingen of wat dan ook, maar gewoon fijn wonen. Voor de rest, mijn hondje. Ja. En daar ben ik gewoon heel tevreden over. Ja. En dan, ik hoef niet zoveel. De waarden in het leven, ja, dat is eigenlijk niet te ingewikkeld doen. En uh, genieten van de dingen zoals ze zijn. Ja. Niet te moeilijk. Ja. Uh, voor mij eigenlijk genieten van elk moment en uh, elk feestje meepakken wat ik pakken kan. Ja. En zijn jullie bewust iedere dag van deze waarden? Min of meer wel, ja. Het kost wel eens moeite, maar uh, op zo'n moment als deze dan... Uh... Ik heb iemand horen zeggen, uh, geluk is een gerucht. Wat betekent, wat betekent dat? Een gerucht is gossip. Ah. Happiness is een gossip. Ja. Ja, bestaat het of bestaat het niet en wat is het dan als het bestaat? Mm. En soms zijn dat uh, ja, hele toevallige momenten dat je je gelukkig voelt zonder dat je eigenlijk weet waarom. Ja, het is gewoon. En dat, is, dat, dat is er dan. Ja. ja, en meer hoef je eigenlijk niet na te streven. Dat is alleen maar moeilijk. Dat is mooi. <laughs> oh, super leuk, super mooi. Oké, okay, the next value I like to mention is connecting with people. And perhaps this ties a bit with the first one that I mentioned, uh, but I don't mean this in a superficial way, like just connecting with new people, but I truly mean true connection. I really like that about this channel, actually, the fact that it's allowed me to meet all these different people throughout this country and meet all you guys online and truly I feel build a bit of a bond. I know for some people that's a little strange or hard to do because they prefer staying with people that you know look or see more like they are or have a similar background but for me I just enjoy connecting people from all different kinds of backgrounds, all different kinds of walks of life and it's something that really enriches my life I would say. What's on y'all about in it Levin? <laughs> Uh, authenticity so you know we live in such a like fast driven sort of consumerist kind of world yeah. and we we don't really have time for meaningful connections and and sort of deep conversations with people that that are coming from like a really solid authentic place yeah 
And when you do have those, it's, it's like such a refreshing experience. We were t discussing earlier, like if you're in a restaurant or a shop, people are not used to you kind of like taking the time to ask them how's their day and mm -hmm. stuff. It's always a superficial, hey, how's it going? Yeah. Yeah. But if you actually kind of like, you know, how's your day been? It's a long one. Like, what yeah. are you doing here? It's yeah, just those little touches here and there. You never know where that goes. Yeah. All right. Hello. What's your name? Uh, Alistair. Uh, you just told me you come from South Africa, you've been here for a month now. Right? Yeah, that's right. I've been here for a month now and so far I'm enjoying it. Uh, quite different than where I come from. I like uh, the living outside and the, the values of your value of family value. Yeah. We do appreciate that and the, the ability to live in a safe environment, I would think. I do appreciate that. I think the value of life, it seems to me, more appreciated here than where I come from. And would you say these things you just mentioned, were these values of yours before you moved here to the Netherlands or are these things that you now... We, yeah. I would say there was values that we try to live by, but uh, it's not necessarily forced <laughs> where I come from yeah. originally. Uh, and here it is. Uh, it's applied, uh, these type of values, the lifestyle and things that comes along. And uh, it's, it's like you're not saying it, you're doing it. Yeah. Now the third value I want to talk about is not taking time and life for granted. Once again, I don't even know if this kind of falls under the category of value, but I'm going to put it there. And what I mean by that is, you know, I feel like it's easy in life to kind of take each day for granted take the people around you for granted, take the things that you have for granted. But I think it's very, very important to just be aware of like how much of a blessing it is to wake up each day or to have the people around you or to have the things that you have. And I never want to lose sight of that. Once again, of course, I'm not perfect. Of course, I have days where I just wake up and, you know, I just don't do my best or I just say, OK, it's just another day. But in general, I try to be very, very aware of like getting as much as I can out of this life, out of each day and really showing my appreciation and love for those things around me, the things that I have in my life. Ik zou graag wat zijn jouw waarden in het leven? Wat zijn mijn waarden in het leven? O, dat is een lastige vraag, die vraag had ik niet verwacht. <laughs> ik denk een gezond en een goed leven leiden zonder, dat je, zonder aanzien des persoons, dat je andere pijn doet in het leven. Dus dat je je leven leidt zonder dat je andere mensen beïnvloedt op een kwade manier. Uh, ja, een waarde van mij is wel eerlijkheid of uh, gelijkwaardigheid. Ja, ik denk zorgzaamheid of behulpzaamheid. Dat vind ik wel heel belangrijk. Hoe zorgen jullie dat jullie deze waarden laten zien in jouw leven? Snap ik bedoel? Um, ja, eerlijkheid is gewoon om altijd ja, eerlijk te zijn, zoveel mogelijk als je kan. Ja. Ja, ik probeer eigenlijk altijd wel gewoon mensen te helpen of zo. Ja, ja gewoon er te zijn voor mensen als ze hulp nodig hebben. Ja. Ja. Gewoon je best doen. Of extra opletten als je inderdaad ziet dat iemand misschien wel hulp nodig heeft. En ja. dan even kijken en vragen vooral. Ja. Nou, de laatste value I would like to discuss is positivity. This is a really, really big one for me, and I find it so awesome that I see comments from people saying they love my positive energy or they love the positivity in these videos. And I don't say that in a cocky way, but I mean more so in a sense that this is just who I am. This is just what God made me to be, and I find it so awesome that I'm able to share this with people, you know, via the internet or people that I meet in these videos in my day-to-day -day life, etc. And I just think it's, you know, there's a surplus of negativity out there in the world, and I find it awesome that I'm able to kind of create this little piece of the internet that has a positive vibe and brings positivity to people in their lives and their days. And uh, yeah, I don't take that for granted. One of my other values, once again, <laughs> not taking things for granted. But yeah, I feel like positivity is something that we can have a little bit more of in this world. Wow, what an awesome video I was able to do here today in the city of Narden. I came across some awesome people that share with me what are their values in life and I got to share with you guys what are mine. I hope you enjoyed it as well and as always stay tuned for the next video. See you to the next one.